Shalom, also most high Christ bless. Shalom, shalom. Why did you join IUIC? I joined IUIC because when I first came across IUIC, I immediately saw the structure and the order. First Corinthians 14 and 40 says that all things be done decently and in order. And that's what I seen when I watched my first video, which was, uh, what's, what's my name? What it brought to my mind, 1 Corinthians chapter 14, verse 29 to 31, where it speaks about letting the prophets speak one by one. And if, and if, if one is speaking and something, and the, and something comes to the other, then let him speak in the other first one, be quiet. And that's what I seen when I watched the first video. And that's what brought me in. How long you been with IUIC? Been with IUIC for five years. What made you decide to look for the most high? Uh, what made me decide to look for, for the most high? I was heavily involved in Christianity, but during the time that I was there, it was always, it was always loopholes. I always had questions that wasn't being answered. It was things that I did, you know, I, I, read, I read the Bible for myself while I was there, and there was a lot of things that wasn't being answered. Uh, I remember you know, when, first, when the truth first came to me, I was at work on my break on a so-called fast, uh, drinking waters and juices, and I was on my break reading, my, reading the Bible, and uh, this guy drove past me, and somehow we made eye contact. He drove out the lot, left. I thought he was going. I continued doing what I was doing. Then, but he actually drove around, got out of his car, and came to speak to me. When he came to speak to me, pretty much let me know that uh, that we, the black so-called black people, are the people of the book. That we are in the Bible. He talked talked about slavery. He talked about how slavery was in the Bible, and he also told me how that Christ was a black man and it was described in the Bible. Uh, he didn't give me the scriptures at the time. He actually didn't take me through the scriptures and show me until. So I didn't stop right then and there. I actually looked, found the scripture that, that said that Christ was a black man. When I read it, I had no understanding. I had no one to actually show me. So I pretty much let it, let it alone and continue my walk in Christianity. But it never left my mind that we were the people of the book. Then two years later from that, I watched a video on Facebook where it was a young man going through Deuteronomy 28 in conjunction with him actually going out and asking different uh, Israelites, African-Americans, asking them what their nationality was. And of course, you got different answers. You got black, you got African-American, you got Christian and so on and so forth. And from that video, it struck, it struck a match inside of me and I started looking and looking and eventually came across IUIC. Um, and from then, that's, I pretty much, that struck a match in me, and I've been born since then. What scripture sealed the deal for you to walk in truth? Uh, Deuteronomy 28 and 68, about us going into, being prophesied that we went into, going into slavery on ships. That sealed the deal, that put it in my mind. That without a shadow of a doubt, we are the Israelites. And that, that coupled with uh, Colossians 2 and 8, um, I actually read through the website, read through all the false holidays, and I was cut to the heart. And from that day forward, I ain't looked back. I left the Christian church, and I started pushing pushing for the most high. What makes you continue to stay with IUIC? I stay with IUIC because the time from the time that I've been here, I've seen the spiritual growth. And when you look at the when you look at the scriptures and you look at Ezekiel chapter 47, it speaks about 47 verse, I believe it's verse one through like one through four, one through five. It speaks about the water rising. And we know that the water is the understanding, it's the scriptures. It's the understanding of the scriptures. And I've seen that since I've been with IUIC. Um, spiritual growth and a constant push to get this truth throughout the nations as Christ instructed us to do. Quote your favorite scripture. Be Matthew 24 and 13, it says, but he that endures to the end shall be saved. Now they will see the true man of God. We are not black men, we are the Israelites.
I'm a Jew with sound art For years I've been walking around saying that I'm a black man I ain't saying that no more, it's sound art, man This is Bishop Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ Please subscribe to our YouTube channels Stay up to date with our latest events, music, and classroom lessons. IUIC plans to continue visiting different countries where this gospel has not been preached before. IUIC needs your help in pushing this truth. So join us, subscribe to our Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and podcasts, and stay up to date with us. For more information, please visit www.israelunite.org.